Okay, we've had to make adjustments on the mouth. We had to take out more out in here. So we get the mouth to open and close properly. So that's going to go there. And then we get the mouth that opens and closes. So we have to drill in the sides here, drill a hole so we can screw this block in. If you enjoy my videos, please like and subscribe on my YouTube page. I'd appreciate it. See if we can hit our spot here. I measured on the inside where it's got to go and then marked it on the outside so hopefully we're in the right area. Good. Then what we're going to do next is where I drilled the holes, we're going to bore that out a little bit so we can inset our screw. And then we'll cover it up when we putty it. an inch and five eighths inch screw for this. So we're going to do the same with the other side. So we're going to screw that into our block here on each end, and then we'll add a little glue on top of this to keep it from turning later on if it gets loose.
And once we get this in there, then we can see if we need to uh, make more adjustments on that mouth. And I see I am going to have to do a little more adjusting on that. We'll get this side in. It's catching down here a little bit, so we're going to have to adjust that some. So, that's good. so what we'll do is we'll put a little glue on here to keep it from rotating if it ever comes loose. Now see, we've got to take the mouth out and we've got to sand a little bit more off on the bottom. So we'll take that out, sand it down a little more, and then put it back. Make sure we got movement on the mouth. Thanks for watching.